For our Monday conversation, we have Jordan Young, the Director of Instruction for Fox Hills. Jordan, most golf courses have a PGA Pro if they're lucky, an assistant if they're really lucky, but you have an entire staff of people and a whole lot of facilities for people to learn the game of golf. Tell us a little bit about what the Fox Hills offers the public. Well, I think you, you hit head on there with our staff. We, are, we have a very talented staff. Uh, very professional, very qualified, and very experienced. Uh, Will Ellender, Brian Cairns, Joelle Harding, Ann Gata, Dan Thomas, uh, Charlie Bowles, Bob McCoskey, myself, uh, a, lot of, a lot of team members from a lot of different areas, women, men, LPGA, PGA professionals, uh, TPI certified with Graham Polikoff. Uh, we provide pretty much everything for everybody here, whether you're three years old or 93 years old. And we can provide you a fitness program as well. And uh, if you're if you're a raw beginner, we have a trunk to the first tee program too. So uh, get golf ready is another program that uh, a lot of people may have heard of. Uh, we've been doing that for years, and uh, we've actually spawned the trunk to the first tee program as well. So we pretty much have it for everybody. And then you also have multi multiple places to practice everything from the facility um, that's out front. You also have your I, I, what, no, I don't know what you, what do you call the complex that we're standing in right now? Well, this is our current learning center. This is uh, this is about a 12 year old building. Um, we're looking to expand. We're kind of getting a little bit too big for our uh, our house here. Uh, we call it the toaster, but um, we're going to try to expand a little bit and uh, look for some announcements in the near future pretty soon. Now, as far as, uh, the, take, talk a little bit about your junior program. My daughter's participated in it, and she she loved the program uh, when she played last year. Um, you know, what are some of the things that the kids are going to learn? Well, we start with our active starters, and our active starters are, you know, our three to seven-year-olds. who so kind of, a, hey, do I like golf? Do I know what golf is? Uh, from there, they graduate to our junior camp, and our best ages for our junior camp are from seven to about 11. And then once they get to 11 or 12 years old, they're kind of too cool to be in the junior camp. So, so they move to our junior elite camp, which is our afternoon session. That's where we incorporate some more smash components, a lot of on golf course stuff. And uh, then once they move out of that, they move into our jet program, which Dan Thomas uh, started. And uh, Dan has flourished with that program and all of our instructors have hopped on too. So that's where we develop a lot of our players into elite golfers and we promote them into college uh, golf scholarships. And you can actually back up what you're talking about Jordan because a couple of players receive scholarships. Do you mind mentioning their names and where they're going to school? Uh, Kelsey McDougall just yesterday recently uh, committed to Butler University so we're very proud. Uh, Dan started with Kelsey. Uh, I've worked with Kelsey over the winter and then Brian uh, took her on the, on the summer. Uh, that's one of our special things here. We, we kind of work as a team and Dan worked with Kelsey for a long time and, and Brian did some work with her down in Florida and then I worked with her up here in the winter while Brian was down in Florida. So it's a team approach and uh, we're just happy to make the parents happy and obviously uh, get some college scholarships for the kids. Now there's a lot more kids than there are college scholarships so for the student athlete who uh, you know they're they're good but they're not college scholarship good you can still they still learn the game here very well and how to interact and uh, how to become a better person and enjoy the game of golf for a lifetime yeah you know not every person that comes to the door is going to be of that caliber um, we try to be pretty honest with everybody and, and lay it out uh, you know my my son personally is 10 years old and he's a hockey player and he thinks he's going to play in the NHL well, I, I, I try not to crush his dreams, but it's probably not going to happen, and I pretty much know it's not going to happen. But if you lay it out for the parents, and, and you and you go on the board, and you look and see how much work is, is involved, and we can tell people inside that they need to hit this many golf balls, or these many quality strikes, and play this many rounds, and this many tournaments, and yet they're doing like 10% of that, they kind of look at their parents, or the parents look at their son or daughter and say, well, we're not doing that. And that kind of really opens the, their eyes and, and, and puts a little reality in front of them. And so for the beginner, the beginner junior, obviously we want them to play golf for as long as they can. That's the goal. We want them to be able to play into their 70s and 80s. And it's a, it's a lifetime sport that you can do. 
Uh, that's our goal, but when somebody's talented, we want to provide the right tools and the right instruction for them to, to reach their dreams. And I think you could probably really reach out to those particular players to make sure that if they, you know, a lot of kids, I, I think more kids have the talent than have the desire, you know, I mean, and what I mean by that is, you, I don't know how many in 10 or how many in 100 you think might be able to, to play in a college scholarship, but let's say you got three out of 100 that come here that could actually earn that, maybe only one of those three really have the talent and will do that you know instead of the 10 percent they will do 90 to 100 and that and i'm fox hills can you guys kind of help uh, kids out if they're a little short generally short on the dough a little bit yeah i mean we have year-round programs um you know obviously we're, we're not in the business of giving free lessons but we do sure. get a lot a lot of help obviously um you know there, there's a lot of kids that, that are here every day and when they're here every day we see them every day how you hitting it, how you doing, hey let's go play nine holes. That's where I think it helps out a lot here at Fox Hills. You know, Brian Cairns, myself, Dan Thomas, Will Ellender, uh, Charlie Bowles, we all still play an active tournament schedule and we're always out trying to play as much as we can. So we take the kids out with us. I think that's the added benefit. Uh, spending an extra two or three hours on the course playing with us, uh, that helps. I mean, I always enjoyed it when I played with my host professional Back when I was 10, 11, 12 years old, that was the thrill of a lifetime. They may not like me as much, or, <laughs> but uh, you know we have a good time out there and uh, we enjoy it. And I think the kids enjoy the bantering back and forth. And actually, this year we're having a a junior versus teaching instructor Ryder Cup format with eight on eight. So uh, there's been a lot of trash talk so far, but we'll see what happens in the end. I, I really don't think I, I know you're producing some great kids, but. Uh, I've seen your roster. I don't think they're going to beat you. <laughs> well, we'll see what happens. <laughs> All right. Well, thanks, Jordan, for coming on and talking about your uh, facilities and your junior golf instructional program. And uh, anyway, we're going to talk about the adults, I think, another time in another conversation. Thank you, Jordan. Thank you.